What's happening guys? So today I want to talk about how you aren't just the way you are. And what do I mean by this? One of the things that I see quite frequently from people is they will say things like, well, this is just how I am, or this is how I've always been. You know, things have always gone this way. I've always had this certain behavior, this certain way of doing things, and there's nothing I can do about it. It's just me. And, you know, because of this, I will not be able to do X, Y, Z. And this is a really dangerous behavior. You know, it's, it's almost like you're just making an excuse that you can't do something that you want to do because you are somehow predispositioned to act a certain way and it's beyond your control and you have no control over the way you act, the way you think, the way you feel, the way you do anything. And it's just very, very disruptive in actually reaching the goals that you have and becoming the person you want to be. And sometimes it's just easier to tell ourselves this because we know what we want to accomplish is going to be really difficult. It's going to be hard. It's going to take a lot of effort and it's going to take some willpower. It's going to take doing things that are uncomfortable and it's going to, there's a good chance that you're going to have plenty of failure along the way. And that just seems too hard and it's, and it scares the crap out of us. So we're afraid, either afraid of failure, afraid of success, Whatever it may be, we, we use the way we are and the way things have always been as a reason why we will not be able to succeed moving forward. It's like our past behaviors now predict our future. And if you always have this train of thought, it always will. It will history will always repeat itself if you choose to believe that you have no control over who you are and the way you do things. Right? You do have the power to change. You do have the power to become better but not if you use who you are as an excuse. So just understand that while you may have certain tendencies, while things may have gone a certain way in the past, that does not mean that you cannot change and that you cannot make improvements and you can't get better and you can't become the person that you wanna be, you can't do the things that you wanna do and that you can't have success. If you choose to believe that it is out of your control, you will never, ever get where you wanna be. So you gotta squash that, okay? I promise you, it will get better, but you have to work on it. You have to be okay that you're afraid, but the only reason that you're afraid to do things is because it's important to you. If it was not important, you wouldn't be scared. You're never afraid of doing things that aren't important to you. The reason you're afraid is because it is important to you. So hopefully that helps somebody. If you have any comments or questions, anything you want to talk about, drop them in the comments below and I will talk to you guys later. I'm addicted to the love that you're giving Every minute, every day I've been craving